Today on MTG Unpacked, we have a very fun video here. We're cracking open one of every Masters set. I'm also including Modern Horizons and Modern Horizons 2. I believe these are the spiritual successes of the Masters series. And this is actually also the last time we'll be doing this before the release of Double Masters 2022. Alright, so I can't wait to get stuck into these. These are some of the most awesome packs you will open in Magic. Leave a note in the comments if you disagree. Alright, Modern Horizons 2. Let's get into it. And this is a set booster, so we will get a list pool here. What is it? Start off with Relearn. Okay. And an art card. That's another difference with these. So this is Karth the Lion, yep, and we also get a Plains, Captured by Lagax, Thornglint Bridge, Deepwood Denizen, Guardian Kirin, Bannerhide Krushok, Necromance is familiar, and Esper Sentinel, nice, that's a sleeve worthy pull, and a Marsh Flats, what the heck, okay, couple of sleeves needed. And a Braids Cabal Minion, that's not too crazy. World Wary Sketch Variant Foil Urban Dagger Tooth. Okay, so we got some pretty crazy pulls already. And uh, yeah, this video may end up in the Greatest Hits playlist, but we'll have to see how we do with the rest here. On to Modern Horizons. So the last time we did this, it was Christmas 2021. We opened one of every Masters pack. That was a lot of fun. Okay, next up we have a Bird Token. And this is where the art card started. I forget what this dude is. Uh, that is Ravenous Giant. And we've got a Snow Covered Plains. And Eladamri's Call is the rare. Not quite as crazy as those others. Lonely Sandbar for the Uncommon's Throat Seeker. Ravenous Giant. There is again Segovian Angel Mob. Universal Automaton. Settle Beyond Reality. Geomancer's Gambit. Maraza Behemoth. Mother Bear. Yumazawa's Charm. Ephemerate. And Choking Tethers. Okay, Double Masters, double the goodness. Who's excited about Double Masters 2022? So you get two rares. I think you also get two foils out of these. So let's hope for some spicy goodness. We've got Lightning Axe, Kozilex Predator, Glaze Fiend, Goblin Gavalier, Parasitic Strix, Flayer Husk, Golem Skin Gauntlet, Sanctum Spirit, Valor in Acros for the Uncommon Sphinx of the Guild Pact, Rush of Knowledge, and Ad Nauseam. There's some iconic artwork right there. I think this made the cut in my top 10 creepiest magic cards video. And Walking Ballista. Okay, there's another nice one. And Foil Angel of the Dawn. Sylvan Might Foil. And a cool Elphoria token. Okay, so you do get the two foils in those. Ultimate Masters at the time, we were thinking this was the best it would get. And then Double Masters came along and said, hold my beer. Okay, so we've got a Fairy Rogue token. Foil Miming Slime. And Reanimate. Not too shabby at all. Uncommon's Anger, Living Law, I think that might be over a buck as well. Snake Umbra, that one too. Ether Snipe for the Commons, Terramorphic Expanse, Treasure Cruise, Walker of the Grove, Gurmag Angler, Foil, Runom, Unicorn, Ingot Chua, Demir, Guild Mage, and Mammoth Umbra. Okay, on to Masters 25, this one. The reception, you know, they promised a lot. I don't think they delivered. This was a bit of a disappointment. We have Balduvian Horde, God's Willing, Presence of Gond, Brainstorm, Pacifism, Murder. Totally lost. There's Fibble Thip, Griffin Protector, Nettle Sentinel, Bloodhunter Bat, Uncommon Simeon Spirit Guide, not too shabby. 
Fiend Hunter, Ravenous Chupacabra, and Stryonic Resonator is the rare, along with a Foil Chandra's Outrage, and a Cool Skeleton Token. Now, Iconic Masters. I have a bit of a history with this one. You might recall the box prices really crashed soon after release, so I was snapping up boxes, but there was a good reason why, because you get totally hosed. So hopefully we won't get hosed today. We have Mark of Mutiny, Survival Cash, Repeal, Keldon Halberdier, Balagad Scorpion, Hunt the Weak, Virulent Swipe, Mannequin, Battle Rattle, Shaman Goblin, Shaman Dragon Bell Monk, Wing Shards, the Uncommons Trepanation Blade, Monastery Swift Spear, that's a decent pull, and Ancestral Vision for the rare, along with a Foil Rare Lord of the Pit, and a Spirit Token. And actually, a lot of the foils were terrible in Iconic Masters, so that one doesn't look like it turned out too bad. Modern Masters 2017 Edition. This was actually the first box of magic I ever opened, first booster packs and everything, all the way back in early 2017. So we've got a Spike Jester, a Creature Goblin Warrior, Arachnus Web, Cathari Bomber, Vampire Aristocrat, Dregscape Zombie, Druid's Deliverance, Gnawing Zombie, Mog Flunkies, another Goblin, Wake the Reflections, Wing Crafter, Uncommons, Banishing Stroke, Compulsive Research, Woolly Thoctar, and Zer the Enchanter for the rare, along with a Foil Mystical Teachings, and Dragon Token. Okay, Eternal Masters. So we did actually open a box of this early in the channel history as well. Um, that's another one I think we got hosed from. So we have Second Thoughts, we had Second Thoughts about that box, Skulking Ghost, Fervent Cathar, Warden of Evos Isle, Emperor Croc, Jungle Hollow, Tidal Wave, Tragic Slip, Bloodfell Caves, Curd Ape, Extract from Darkness for the Uncommons, Ancestral Mask, some iconic artwork right there, Honden of Night's Reach, I think that's a good one as well, and Crater Hellion, I don't think that's up there. And a Foil, a Messy Tome, and a Goblin Token. Good to see some goblins represented here. Now these are some odd packs, Mon Masters 2015. They've got a little pull tab here, and you rip it open. Unfortunately, there were complaints of uh, cards being damaged, and uh, people thought you could uh, easily reseal those, so... Yeah, they uh, did not do that again. Dress the part. What's this? So some ad. We've got a spirit token on the other side. That's pretty cool. And rampant growth. Skyreach Manta. Stoic rebuttal. Otherworldly journey. Ghostly changeling. Helium squirter. Brute force thrive. Dark steel citadel. Cathodian. And Mutagenic Growth for the Uncommons, Ashen Moor, Gouger, Oblivion Ring, and Splinter Twin, okay. And a Foil Electrolyze, and that's it. Isn't Spl Splinter Twin still banned? What is it banned in Modern, I think? Okay, Modern Masters, the original that started this madness. I was actually thinking about uh, opening a whole box of this. Considering they're about half the price of a double Masters box, holy crap, and this is all the way back in 2013. So we have Nantuko Shaman, Thieving Sprite, Petals of Insight, Dispeller's Capsule, Warren Weirding, another Goblin, excellent otherworldly journey, Mog War Marshal, it's the Goblin Pack, Sylvan Bounty, Siphon Life, Spell Stutter Sprite, Thirst for Knowledge for the Uncommons, Flick-A-Wisp, Thundercloud Shaman, and Revelark is the rare. Will we get a foil? Yes, Aether Spellbomb. And a very cool Goblin Rogue token. I don't think I have that one in my collection. So there we have it, Modern Masters. Every pack 
we got some cool stuff. Hope you enjoyed. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Mm -hmm.